Hey, hey, y'all. It's Michelle from Monkey's Creations. Come on in. Come on in. Just trying to pull y'all up. There you are. There you be. waiting for comments to make sure they c come up. So say hey, hello Tony. Alright, we got comments. We're ready to rock and roll. What have y'all been up to? I feel like it's been forever. Forever, forever. Good morning, good morning. So, have y'all figured out what I'm doing with the shield mirror? I'm trying to, well, either way, it's a mirror, so. <laughs> you can see my room. There you go. <laughs> so this is a shield mirror that I got from Amazon. Have you figured it out? Anybody? 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 So, we are going to put this on uh, the ring board. The ring board. Good morning. Um, with some red and black wide stripe mesh. And I think that's all I'm going to tell you for now. I think that's all I'm going to tell you. You're just going to have to wait. Hello, hello. If y'all would float my boat, I would appreciate it. Um, I am going to bring y'all down so that we can maybe get started. I tighten it up and now it's really hard to move. You love that attitude? <laughs> so, I am going to make the petals. So, these are all cut 10 by 10. Um, I did wood burn them. Y'all, I just find it easier just to wood burn it. Um, with this petals that I'm using, you do not need to wood burn it. Um, I just think it's easier. I don't know why. I don't know why. So, I've got my bands. So, these are cut 10 by 10. Thanks for floating my boat. I appreciate it. Diamond shape. Y'all have seen me make this petal a hundred times, so this will probably give it away. But don't say anything. Don't say nothing. <laughs> so, diamond shape, top to the bottom. Line up those edges. Hello, hello. We're going to bring left to right. Okay, just like that. So that's what you have. I missed y'all too. Turn it sideways. Now we're going to bring bottom to the top. Just kind of line those up. And right here, you can see where these petals meet. And I'm going to put my finger right in there. And I'm stretching it and pulling it, y'all. Just to kind of elongate that and make it curve just a little bit more okay um, and then I'll just pinch it I pinch mine at the 26 I line it up at the 20 pinch at the 26 good morning and then we're just gonna band it just like that okay so we're gonna do that one more time 10 by 10 diamond shape top to the bottom 
left to right. Kind of smash it down. Turn it sideways, bring bottom to the top, and then put that finger in and pull and stretch that out. I'm lining this tip up with the 20, pension at the 26. That way all of our petals, oh, don't do that y'all, don't break it, are the same, okay? For the black one, same thing, 10 by 10, diamond shape, top to the bottom. You feeling a fairy tale vibe? Okay, now here's the different petal. We're gonna bring right just past this tip, probably about an inch, and I'm putting my finger right here at this tip because this I want as pointed as I can get it, okay? We're gonna bring this tip down past, so that's about a two inch. So we're gonna bring this down past about two inches and just kind of line those up, but up here is what's important. I just wanna smush that, that Evil Queen vibe. That way I get a nice tip and then right here where these two kind of meet, I'm just pinching it and we're gonna band that again. Just like that. Okay, so here is my layout. So my mirror is gonna go right here. Okay. So we are only using, now just remember I'm winging it, it may change. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So 15 red, 15 black, 15 red. So 30 red and 15 black total. Okay, so right here's the top. So we're doing one, two, three, leaving it empty. Bottom, we're just doing the one and empty. Does that make sense? All right, so we are going red, red, black in the middle. Red, red, black. Good morning. So many of you are probably wondering why you didn't get a text. So I have stopped using my text messaging app. Um, just y'all, I'm just tired of getting nickeled and dimed to death. Um, so I canceled it. So I'm gonna start creating events. Um, so if you sign up for the event, um, then Facebook should notify you um, when I go live, okay? Until I fill out, figure out another way um, to send messages without being charged out the wazoo for everything, okay? So floating my boat right now is gonna be the best thing that y'all can do to get this video out there. So just adding the black. Now I'm not gonna mess with any of my petals yet. Um, Nancy, this is a zip tie gun, so it tightens and cuts the zip ties all at once. Notify in the comments, face maybe, and you make sure you're following. So if you click on the flag on my shirt, you'll see three buttons at the top pop up. Hit those three buttons. Um, and then scroll down and make sure all your notifications are turned on. Um, and then Facebook should notify you as well. OK, 
Good morning. Y'all, so y'all know we went to Chicago last week. And me, Lori, and Jackie were all... Like, we couldn't even sleep. We were coming up with so many ideas for the dragons. So just wait. Hang on tight. Because there's a lot coming on. Coming up. Well, hello, Mr. Waterman. I'm glad you and your mom are feeling better. Thank you for floating my boat. Notify on the page can call you after the live later and tell you. Oh yeah, perfect. Perfect. So who was going to crafters convention? Give me a thumbs up if you're going to crafters convention. Give me a smiley face if you need a ticket for crafters convention because there's a, a few who um, can't go and so there's tickets available y'all or there's live stream tickets so if you can't go in person you can watch on the big screen Regina's coming y'all we are having an after party <laughs> we're having an after party um, in Nashville so a few of my besties are coming back with me to Nashville I'm gonna spend a few days so we can have some fun relax Charlotte are you serious why are you not coming y'all I have been every year since crafters convention started every year someone better take <laughs> you know it's not gonna be me girl <laughs> I ain't taking that bourbon hi hi hey Deanna are you going to crafters convention So I'm adding this third zip tie just because it makes it a little bit easier. Um, you don't have to deal with three zip ties right in a row. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. That stinks. It stinks, man. But I'm going to try... Oh, okay. Right, Regina? <laughs> I don't know why I thought you were going. So who's made the dragon yet? Anybody made the dragon? Y'all, I was playing yesterday and wait till you see what's next. It's gonna be amazing. Hey, hey. Oh, you're going to Wreath Makers Live, gotcha. Nadine's done two dragons. All right, we've got two more sets left for my recovery from my hip replacement. Oh, and I just missed it. I haven't gone down the dragon pit. <laughs> and have you on YouTube running in the background? Yay! You've made three. 
working on a red one. I, y'all, I don't know that I have, every time I make a new design, it's my favorite. You love me. I do too. I just think they're so fun and so many color combinations and everything that you can do. I'm just like, oh. All right, so I think this is my last row. Now I do, um, I do, um, I just totally lost my train of thought. Have extra petals if I need them. You're getting ready to make one? There, I know. There's so many different ones. I'm going to make an ice dragon. Ice, ice, baby. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> You're going to make four more before August? You like my petal bends? I'm trying to be more organized, y'all. Um, these are, I don't know, just, just pull up plastic bins on Amazon. And that's where I got those. Okay, so here's where we're at. So our mirror, yes, it's gonna work. <laughs> Our mirror is going to attach. So what I've done is there's already a hanger at the top. Um, I undid the screw just a little bit and wrapped the pipe cleaner around that screw and screwed it back down. So I have two pipe cleaners top and bottom that we're going to attach. And I'll turn it over once I figure it out. Okay, so that lined up. That's good. I did put black marks where I thought that the um, mirrors would hit. And so far, I'm right on the money. Am I? I'm going to have to bring it down one more. So this mirror I found looking up um, Amazon. Y'all know I scroll Amazon a lot, a lot, a lot. I'm trying to find new and different things. Um, so that's how I found this mirror. I think I pulled up... Um, goth mirror or something and it pulled came up with a shield mirror good morning Deanna I sent you a message girlfriend okay now I don't have it tight tight because I want to make sure everything's going to lay out correctly. So have you figured out what I'm doing yet? Anybody? Oh, and my eyes, my eyes just popped off. I did this really quick. And I just hit it and pulled my eyes right off. So we are doing the dragon. Yes, yes, yes. Um, but they just popped off, so I'm going to have to fix that. So what I'm thinking is, 
my dragon is going to kind of sit kind of right there. I turned it around so y'all could see where my thinking is. And then we've got the, I'm just going to do one wing, I think. Kind of sitting kind of right there. And then the tail hanging down. So it kind of looks like he's just wrapping around. Now I did play with the idea of putting it directly in the middle or putting it on the ring board. Um, so it's, it's kind of up to you if you make this, how you're going to lay it out. There's so many ways to do it um, that it's, it's just going to be up to you how you want to do it. So let's find... some holes. Mine have been glued back on three times with different glue. Nothing works. Now the E6000 works really well. Um, as does my um, Gorilla Gel Glue. But I was in a hurry and I just wanted it to hold while I did the live. Um, because you cannot use just hot glue on these eyes y'all and the mask they will fall off okay oh I know what I'm gonna do we're going to and I'll turn it over and show you so it kind of wraps around a little bit more yep that's what I want So it's more a uh, curvy, I guess, is the word I'm going to use. Okay, so I did one here and one here. If I put one here, then it's going to face just kind of out. But if you diagonal them, then it will give you that curve that you're looking for to go with the dragon. Does that make sense? Is your family is taking them? <laughs> yep, yeah, mine too. So I think this is good. What I'm gonna do is go ahead and tighten these down as it's working out for me. Now just remember, I do still have to add the eyes back, so don't worry about that. And you can put the mirror in a little bit more if you wanted. What I may what I may end up doing is kind of adding the outer row of the red, thinking you'll still be able to see some of it kind of coming around. I may end up doing that. And I may end up putting something behind that to hold it in place, okay? So let's figure out that. And then that goes, and my light just went out. Why 
does that. So I'm thinking kind of about right there. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my awl. going to put a hole, run it right through, just like that. We're going to grab a zip tie, Let's see if we can get it through, yes! where I wanted it. Yes. I love doing different things with them. Why does my light keep going out, y'all? We might have to adjust the, the wing because I don't know how it's going to sit once it's up, right? And then for the tail, I'm going to do the same thing. Take my awl, run it right through that tail. It's Grandma saying hi. Well, Grandma, I love you, but if you could leave my lights alone, please. <laughs> I'm going to do the same thing. Now, if you don't want your tail to be on permanent, just use the bracket that's attached. But I sell these, so I don't want to sell them and have the customer have to put anything together. Does that make sense? I want it all to be attached. I'm thinking about right there. Now I will turn this over so you can kind of see where I'm attaching everything. in the French. <laughs> so that's kind of what we have. Look how cool that is, y'all. And my thing needs to be a little straighter. There we go. You were in a meeting? What? She's trying to, she probably is. <laughs> Grandma was so money, money conscious. Conscience. Con now I can't say the word Conch, cosh, cautious. I can't say the word. <laughs> so that's kind of what we have. Now we can kind of leave it like that. And that tail is going to, I think, hold up perfectly or the um, wing. But do we kind of want 
the tail to kind of wrap around. What do y'all think about that? To kind of wrap it around or should we just let it hang? What do y'all think? So let it hang or wrap it around. Let's see if I can do it this way. I like it both ways. Like he's protecting the mirror. I think so too. Let me face it to me. And then we can fix all of our petals. Let me see. How do I want it? I want you to be able to see it as well, though. You know what I'm saying? Let me just see what this looks like. But then you can't hardly see the scales. See what I'm saying? What about that? I think I kind of like it that way. So let's fix our... Scales. We all know I like precision with my scales. Don't ask me why. So what I kind of do is I kind of, kind of, um, you don't think he wants his tail to totally disappear. And, the, and that's kind of what I'm thinking as well. That's why I want to fix the petals the way I'd normally have them um, and then see what actually shows. should have put these in place before I put my head on.
Is she in line to attach the tail so you can adjust it? You could do that for sure. For sure, for sure. Let's get that in place. Now, I'll, once I hang it up, I'll be able to look at it better. But I think I'm going to leave the tail hanging. As much as I like it wrapped around, you don't see it. Once I put all of the petals in place. Unless I can kind of... Yeah. So I think I I'm gonna leave it hanging. You got an adult, doesn't that stink? <laughs> But I am thinking because I want kind of the illusion. Well, do I though? Maybe I don't. Do I want the scales, red scales coming up? I was thinking I kind of wanted the illusion that the dragon was wrapped all the way around, but that doesn't make sense, does it? except just for it looking cooler, like way cooler. Yeah, I'm gonna add the eyes, the eyes, I did the eyes quickly and they popped off, y'all. And I did it with, with, with um, hot glue and, and I, I just thought it would stay while I was doing it. Um, but y'all, you have to use either E6000 or the Gorilla Gel Glue when you attach it because it popped right off. Okay? But there will be eyes in it, I assure you. Um, let me... I'll get them. I'll get them put back on before I take a picture. Um, because I just thought it was kind of cool, he, and it's it's a it's a shield, so he's it's a shield mirror, so he's kind of you know wrapping his body around the shield. Oh, that's better. If you then maybe move the tail further down the back. So I think that's it. So let me turn it so you can kind of see the placement. So I've got the tail here the wing about one, two, three sets up, the head here, the mirror here, um, and once I love where everything's at for sure, um, then I will cut these down and put them back in the hole so you do not see them, okay? Back up. So there you go, y'all. And I may, I may put another hole in the the wing so that it does not flop down. So I will get that fixed. I think it's cool. He's protecting his shield, protecting his man. Thought maybe you were making up a Disney. <laughs> No, <laughs> I'm not making it up. Not making it up. 
All right, y'all. Any questions? Any questions? That one was fun. But I've got a, a couple more. We came up with a couple more designs. So I will probably do... Um, I told the VIP group it was going to be Friday, but I think I'm going to move it to Thursday because Friday um, is Flower Friday on Unique in the Creek. So I will be on there making a Sarah flower. So if you've never made a Sarah flower, want to know how to do it, I will be making it live Friday on Unique in the Creek. Um, so I will do um, probably the other one Thursday. Thursday, baby. Because my other stuff is coming in today. So that'll give me today to play. All right. That's all I've got, y'all. So have an amazing day. I'm going to figure out how to get a picture of this amazing thing. I really do miss um, my wood fence. <laughs> I'm gonna, maybe I'm going to have to make a, a mock-up wood fence on wheels. Um, who has a horizontal wide stripe? Um, Unique in the Creek. Um, did have the black 21-inch wide stripe. Now, I've showed y'all how to break that 21-inch down to the size you need to make these. Um, so, that's what I've been doing. I ordered the 21-inch, cut it down. Um, so that I would have a ton of it. Um, but I'm not sure if Unique in the Creek has the red stripe. I'm pretty sure they do. They did. Um, so check there. All right. All right. That's all I've got for y'all. So have an amazing day. Um, I will be live um, tomorrow. No. I won't. I'll be live in the VIP group hopefully tomorrow. Um, this weekend, there's also a marathon that I am a part of. So it's going to be another crazy week for me. So hang tight. Make sure you check the event section um, because that's where I'll be setting up all of my notifications. So if you see the events, click on them. Let me know you're going. And then Facebook will notify you when I'm going live until I figure out another text messaging app that I can use um, that won't nickel and dime me to death. All right. Um, what mesh do you use? I really like using the horizontal wide stripe, but I've used them all now. Um, I've used the fabric. I've used the poly. Um, I've used regular deco mesh, the heavily fold mesh. They all work. I just prefer the look of the horizontal wide stripe. But they all work, y'all. Okay? All right. I'm out of here. Y'all have an awesome day. VIP. I will probably see y'all tomorrow. Bye, y'all.